Did you know that there is a Boeing 747 that carries a fifth engine on a separate little wing sticking out right behind the cockpit? In this episode of Exploring Rare Aircraft, we're going to explore Pratt & Whitney's unique 747 testbed aircraft. Stay tuned. Before I dive deep into this very odd 747, consider subscribing to my channel. All you have to do is press that red button below. Also, I recently released a Aerofly Mobile Flight Simulator giveaway, so if you haven't already, make sure to go check it out. Just click that I button in the top right corner of your screen. Pratt & Whitney were founded back in 1925 by a former manager at Wright Aeronautical. Yes, the same Wright brothers that invented the first powered flight airplane. He decided to start a company of his own, Pratt & Whitney. Pratt and Whitney have produced many successful engines in the past, with the military and for civil aviation. But more recently, Pratt and Whitney have used a very unique testbed aircraft to test their new engines. It is a modified 747 SP that has a fifth engine mounted onto the fuselage right on the second deck. There is a little extended wing that mounts an extra engine that Pratt and Whitney can test. I'll let you see this oddity for yourself. As you can see, Pratt & Whitney have a very odd looking testbed aircraft. Other engine manufacturers that have similar testbed aircraft are primarily based on the 747. Some engines that were tested on this aircraft were the engines for the A220, the A320neo, the Embraer E2 family, the Irkut MC21, and the Mitsubishi Space Jet. The purpose for their aircraft is to go through the lengthy engine certification and development process. With four other engines to rely on, there shouldn't be a problem if the test engine needs to be shut down or stopped. Inside the aircraft, there is a crew of engineers and technicians that take data from the tested aircraft and use it to help the certification process and design. The whole interior has been stripped, and computers and data collectors with engineers to monitor is the new interior. Flight time can vary, but flights can last as long as 8 hours. Pratt & Whitney has used in the past older 747s that have one of the four engines removed or a fifth engine placed next to the engine closest to the fuselage. But having it as a fifth engine can offer some advantages. Shutting the engine off if needed without having to share the job with us free engines is definitely a plus. It seems to offer more flexibility for the testing process. It does really seem like an odd configuration, but they must have their adequate reasoning for such an odd setup. Pratt & Whitney have produced some of the best smaller fuel efficient engines for smaller regional and narrow body aircraft. Some highlights are the A220's engine, the 1500G, and the A321neo's engine, the 1100G. This is a really interesting modification of the 747. Definitely up there with some of the weirdest 747 modifications ever made. If you enjoyed this video, consider giving it a like. Also, if you're interested in weekly original aviation content, consider subscribing to my channel. That's it for this video, and I will see you in the next.